What's happening, John Line guys? Welcome back to Beat Cop. This is day 13, and we're gonna jump right into the action here. Like always, of course. Precinct 69. Day 13, Church of the Third Revelation. This ought to be interesting, I guess. Let's see how you did yesterday. Ticket quota met. Cars towed? Good job. Patrol completed. Perfect intervention. Good call sorting it out with that guy. What about the, the intervention, Kelly? Overall, keep it up, Jack. Keep it up. That's it for today. Let's move on to the attractions. Bad day, boss. Goddamn McNabb. Ever heard of mints? <laughs> it's as if the seventh circle of hell just split open in here. Listen up. The street's crawling with fuck nuts. And for once, I ain't talking about you, Shepensky. Thanks, boss. They call themselves the Church of the Third Revelation. They figure today they'll give, or sorry, they'll get their five minutes in the spotlight. It's some sort of cult, and the press is already up my ass about it. Satanists? Nope, but it's run by some serious wacko. Get rid of their posters, and chase those punks away. This is part of a bigger propaganda campaign, so take care of it. I want my best as quiet as the IRS Commission's funeral. So get the show on the road, asshats. Alright, well let's see what we can do. I swear to god, every time I sit down to record, I hear myself like louder and louder in the mic and I, I still don't touch the gain, so god knows. Okay, so we're to combat, combat the propaganda action organized by the Church of the Third Revelation. Rip down the propaganda posters. There's one right there. Don't think I really have to worry about uh um tickets today. Another one right there. We'll go for the posters first. If I find tickets after, we'll do the tick or if I have nothing after, rather, we'll do the tickets next. <coughs> That's it for that side of the street. Let's head to the other way. See if we find anything else over here. I'm trying to keep my eyes uh, open so I see everything, but. Never know, sometimes you can miss something. <coughs> Excuse me. There's another one right there. Guys in the alleyway. That's got to be the last one right there. So I just have to combat whatever they do now. I did see that. Cultist reported preaching outside Methodist workshop. Get over there as fast as we can. Wants to meet me tomorrow morning. I did see a light on this one. <clears throat> Gotta keep busy somehow, right? So, like I said, we'll write up some tickets. Must be a guy blasting his music from in there. Didn't mean to check that, I just got sidetracked. <coughs> Never mind, it's the uh these guys with the room box right there. Trying to figure out where the music was coming from. Like all these potential tickets just waiting to happen. 
was probably not too impressed I ticketed him. See anything wrong with that car, so start heading the opposite way. Report at 605. I'm not gonna make it there in time. First of all, I got something to do on the other side of the block. Secondly, I have no reason I should help you guys. Should have towed that asshole's car. I don't know if I missed my chance. Move it. I bet you this one over here was just a, uh, a ploy to get me on the other side of the street. Not necessarily by the cops, but by the uh, these cultists. What was I looking for? 631. Chief, Angie's here. I'd rather talk to her in private. You gotta be kidding me. In that case, yeah I am. Angie, can you tell me what's going on? I'm scared. They're gonna kill me, just like Lester. Who? I can only make guesses. So? Remember that break-in at the senator's house? Yeah, hard not to. Exactly. There are two of them there. Kenneth, who you'd whacked, and Terrence, my boo. If there'd been two, I'd have whacked two. This ain't funny. Terrence split with some precious shit he jacked from the safe. Diamonds? Yeah, but that ain't all. What else? Videotape. Somebody's killing people over a videotape? That don't make no sense. That videotape's most, more valuable than the stones. This footage uh, could bring the senator down. Got it? This might be what they're looking for. That, that would explain a lot. They want it back, and they figure we got it. We? Lester, Terrence, me. Why you of all people? Terrence, cause he jacked it. Me, cause I'm in the movie. Lester, because he was in uh, everything. Great. Where's the tape? Don't know. Terrence might have it. But he gone fucked right off. Ah, uh, trust me. We're going to find that punk, all right? Easy, easy. There's enough bodies on the street as it is. The tape turns up. You let me know, all right? Or what? Or you might find yourself way out of yourselves way out of your depth on this. I'll sort it out. We'll see. We don't do no deals with pigs around here. Can't say I give two fucks about that. This ain't a game, all right? I'll see you in two days. I'll be at my friend's. 633 apartment 7. What about the diamonds? Who gives a shit about some stones? I bet Terrence already pawned them off to some fence. This ain't good. You gotta lay low. You're the one all out, uh... You're the one all out and proud on the street. With that little ticket book and that said pop gun of yours. Yeah, yeah. And her dicks can't measure up to yours either. Firstly, I want to say... Why do people put themselves in that scenario? If they have like a videotape of themselves in like a risky situation, why keep it? Like you're just setting yourself up to get shit on pretty much. What state today? Uh, so day 14, I gotta be apartment 633. Try to remember that. All right, let's go find these posters. I swear to God, I'm gonna walk the other side of the street and the poster's gonna be there. Great. It's 
tomorrow I'm also supposed to talk to uh, Adam Askey. I haven't seen any of these posters yet. One right there. Second one. There's gotta be, yeah, there's a couple here. Jesus. It's a good thing I'm heading that way. I still got more posters to rip down, apparently. I don't see any over here. I swear to God. If I walk to the other side of the block and there's posters there now, I'm gonna be so mad. Like, that wasn't there before. I got a call. Officer is bad, very bad. What happened? Who's that girl? Ma. Maddie. She's the daughter of one of our par. Our parishioners he hasn't been to church in weeks can you tell me why you're crying he he's gone k k k what's he gonna do sweetheart kill himself oh holy trinity sweet jesus let us pray it's bad very bad fuck get your shit together father who are you talking about kid your daddy yeah 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 i heard him talking to uncle 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 got something to do with it yes they kept talking about it they were saying there were many friends waiting, and that they were ready and they'd take me with them. My God, poor child. Tell me, sweetheart, where can I find them? Uncle lives above the drugstore. And what's his name? Lewis. And where do you live? Can you tell me? We live at 609 number 3. I'm begging you, save my daddy. He was already dressed. He might have left the house. Sweet Virgin Mary, Holy Trinity. Okay, so find Lewis above the drugstore and Maddie's father at 609. I'm going to go to the drugstore first just because it's obviously, it's on the way. I'm pretty sure it's going to be before 609, so. And it sounds like, uh, I passed it, shit. I got sidetracked. Lewis, Lewis. I mean, to be fair, who said they were going to answer the door? I should have tried the neighbors. Six or nine. Come on, run. Shit, what was her name? Apartment three. See where it goes. Grab a hot dog on my way. That's <laughs> why wouldn't I? One went into six two one. Ah, uh, okay. Kind of curious where do they go?
more cultist shit. been preparing for this moment for a while now. I gave you everything. I gave you life. Now you will give back what's most precious. Take this from me. One each. Raise your hands and wait for a sign. Please, everybody get down. I said down. Damn it, you're under arrest. Everybody stay back. Backup arrives at the scene. Among the cheers of his followers, Reverend JJ is put in a police car. This is the end of the Church of the Third Revelation, 30 minutes later. I mean, we probably should have worried for backup first, or called for backup first, and then, you know, whatever. One of those ones I can't skip. Just gotta wait until, you know, I finish reading. Either that or wait the 30 minutes later. This is essential. Good work, 421. You're looking at a commendation from the boss. Mention a raise. <laughs> Might as well write tickets to end the day off. Tires. There's a fire hydrant here. I know that for a fact. See, I'm starting to remember our block. That guy's coming out. Uh, wasn't sure if that was him or not. Tire. Headlight, too, actually. I'll just go with tires, though. First thing I've seen. So, this guy's car, too. Working. That was a true hundred and fiftieth ticket. It's crazy. And like I said, I've played this before too, so obviously But I never made it this far. The furthest I made it was uh Robert the jewelry store. The furthest I made it was uh there he is right there. Um I remember doing the one where I had to keep the street clean or clear of all cars, and then I think I stopped at that one. Pretty sure the clearing the street of all the cars was the last one I played. Last day I did, rather. Two things I gotta do for tomorrow. I gotta meet Adam Askey. I gotta do something else. What was it, though? It's gonna bug me shit. Lucky. No, I, I honestly can't remember what it was. Oh, Adamaski and that woman, the dog I almost killed. See, I remember stuff. I'll keep writing tickets. Could just sit around and do shit all, but... I mean, we got time to kill. Who knows, we might even get paid for all these tickets we made. We're definitely gonna get something, considering we stopped that cultist group. That's it for us today. See how we did here. I removed all the propaganda posters, I chased away all the cultists, I prevented the cultist mass suicide, and I got my paycheck. 
So day 13 recap, we're at $664, max out police ranking, minus 45 Mafia, minus 16 crew, and the people like us.